Hey guys, welcome back. In this lecture, we're gonna study about commands and statements that we use in GW Basic. So, the two types of entries that we make in GW Basic are, of course, uh, the first one is uh, commands, the second one is statements. So, coming to commands, so what are commands? Now, commands are instructions that can be directly executed. Uh, what I mean by that is, uh, for example, whenever you open GW Basic and you type a command, you give it a command, and it will uh, directly execute it. It will uh, not create any hassle. It will not create any error. So uh, the examples are auto, list, save, run, etc. Um, so what auto does is, uh, we usually uh, use auto command whenever we are about to type a program. So auto, uh, uh, when we will type this uh, command. Uh, every time you press enter you will enter a line that will be numbered by itself so we don't have to number uh, ourselves uh, lines ourselves uh, because we sometimes make errors in doing that uh, so the list command and on list is used to display uh, or list uh, a program a whole program or a part of that program so uh, yeah, the next command is the save command as the name specifies save command is used to save a program and uh, The next command is the run command and now the uh, run command is used to um, uh, Start the execution of a program or to run a program and obtain results So commands are of course they can be executed in direct mode. Now, What is direct mode? Direct mode is when there is no program you just open GW basic you just type a command and the uh, computer executes it um, you don't have to um, make separate lines and uh, number them give them uh, numbers so that is when there is direct mode so coming to the statements part now what are statements statements can only be executed as part of a program so uh, they cannot be executed in direct mode of course that is commands can be executed in both direct mode and program mode but statements these lads they they can only be executed when they are included in programs when we include them in programs so uh, the examples are rem let print and etc et so uh, rem command is used to specify the function of a program uh, of, uh, they are uh, kind of used when you are making a good program uh, 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 they are used to uh, they they help the end developer someone who uh, wants to modernize or modify a program uh, the the rem command helps them so uh, these are basically used for technical people you will learn more about this command uh, one uh, statement whenever uh, when we will uh, uh, learn more uh, do practicals uh, GW basic for GW basic so let statement of a let is used to specify the value of a variable. Uh, and the print statement is of course uh, used to print this uh, the uh, the result of the execution that is carried out in a program. Now the end statement is used to uh, specify the line where we end the program. So yeah. So the major difference between commands and statements is that commands can uh, can be executed in both the direct mode and Mm, uh, the program mode well on the other hand statements can only be executed in the program mode as I told you earlier so that was uh, all for today's lecture guys keep visiting my channel and uh, like share and subscribe and I'll meet